What's going on guys, Lego Ninjago Fan 53 here, and today I'm coming at you guys with my review for that um, exclusive battle pack from the Lego Star Wars Lego Land. So yeah, let's jump straight into the review and we'll start off with Tournament Zane. So honestly, this figure is amazing. He completes the set for the tournament's um, robes, even though he really wasn't in the show. Great minifigure. So you start off by getting his Air Jitsu mask, I'm pretty sure it is, because it has no printing on there. A really good looking face where half of it is all metal, which I really love. And then his tournament robes, which you can see the inside, and uh, they're just like any others, like Soak J's, Cole's, all of those. Uh, it's all the same. You get one shuriken and um, this really cool looking ice staff. So you get these really cool pieces. I don't have any of these, so it's really awesome that I got a few. Um, really love those pieces. So altogether, Zane is actually a really good minifigure. He really wasn't in the show in this suit, but I love it. I love it a ton. So let's jump straight into our next figure, Nia. Oops. So uh, just like Zane, Nia is also exclusive. So we'll start off with her weapons. So she has like this red spike staff. I don't remember. I think it came in like her spin jitsu or spinner. Um, probably back in like 2012 or something. But yeah, so then let's take off the helmet. It's the same as most other samurai helmets. It's still got the little red piece, the golden horns, and then the black helmet. But this time she actually has an exclusive face. So let's take a look at that. Let me see if it'll focus. There we go. So she's got more of like a smirk this time. And uh, I'm pretty sure it's different than most of her faces. But what definitely makes this head exclusive is it has a dual face, which shows her, um, I guess you could say cyborg almost. So that looks actually pretty good. So if you wanted to go ahead and put it on there. There you go. And uh, the body and the legs are completely, uh, I'm pretty sure they're new. Tell me down in the comment section below if they aren't new or something, because I honestly can't remember. But she also has the deep stone um, armor pad. So uh, that's really kind of a bummer. I wish they put in like the gunmetal gray one, but it looks really good. So let's move on to our pirates. So the first pirate here, they're both unnamed, sadly. Um, but this guy right here is amazing. He comes with this really cool looking turban. So let's take that off, get a better look. And uh, he has this really funny looking face. He looks just like a average pirate. And he's got a peg leg and one green leg. And then he's got a flintlock flint pistol. There's the back. And then one sword. And on to our final minifigure. So this one is probably... I don't know. He's... Nah. He's probably not really my favorite. Um, but I do like his accessories. He comes with like this little torch piece right here. You can clip fire in there. There's that. And then, oops, sorry guys, I knocked my camera over. Uh, he has this really cool sailor hat almost, and it has the Pirates logo on there. I think that's actually pretty neat. I didn't notice that up until right before I started making this video. He has the, uh, no, he does not have the same chest as the other pirate. He's got this kind of angry expression with his unibrow, <laughs> which I really like. He's got some cool legs with all, like, the straps and stuff on there. And then on the back, he has these two little, um swords i guess you could say daggers almost he's got a sword holder as well it's really cool looking so he's armed to the teeth i guess so he's obviously going to take on some ninja there we go so yeah thank you guys so much for watching this quick little video uh sorry um i don't sound as energetic i'm really tired right now i fell asleep at like two or three in the morning yeah, bad uh, bad sleep habits. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, let me know what you guys want me to do. I have a Sky Shark review, and I think I have my um, Misfortunes Keep review still to do. So tell me which one you want next in the comment section below. Thank you guys so much for watching, as always, and love you. Bye.